Okay, Coach, you're headed up to uh, Old North State Club to defend your ACC championship uh, starting on Friday. Um, you've won four in a row in six of the last seven. Uh, obviously, other teams, Duke and Florida State included, uh, probably gunning for you. What's the mindset as you go? Well, you know, hopefully they're they're chasing us, and we're just going to go play the golf course. Um, you know, we're fortunate. The Golf Club of Georgia is a lot like Old North State, so I think from a condition standpoint, we'll be ready for that. And uh, the guys have worked hard. You know, this is kind of get to where the end of the year, and um, things matter more. People remember things more than they do during the year. So. Uh, I think they're excited and ready to go, and the key is just not to, to make too big a deal out of it. Do the guys on the team talk about the four in the row and the six out of seven and you know maintaining that tradition of Georgia Tech golf winning the ACC championship? How big a deal is that to them? If, if they do, they don't do it when I'm around. Mm -hmm. um, but I, I'm sure they're aware. Uh, everybody understands it. So they may do it when I'm not there, but I, I know it means a lot to everybody. And uh, again, like I say, you just try not to talk too much about it and you just got to go play the golf course. We've chatted a little bit about um, how inexperienced this team is from a standpoint of having played this golf course, uh, this group that you're taking up there this week. Um, how much does that matter? Well, what you hope is the, the guys who've been there are telling the, the new guys that are going there that, you know, that we always play well there and get them thinking in that direction. and. Um, you know, obviously, probably more critical to have a good practice round from um, for the younger guys to kind of know where they're going, where the the others who've been kind of know their way around there. So that's probably a, a you know a very critical day for us. But um, you know, I'll just go with the old adage: the ball doesn't know how old you are, and um, and go from there. Does it uh, the fact that the tournament has been played there the last I don't know dozen years or so? that wealth of knowledge that you carry and you know from having been on that golf course so many years how big of an advantage is that uh, or does it really even matter um ho well hopefully it does or <laughs> we could get somebody else to take them but uh you know you've seen a lot and hopefully during the course of the practice round and maybe some moments during the tournament you could step in and try to help somebody that hasn't seen something that you've seen before so hopefully uh, the experience would would be of benefit to the guys What's your mind, what's your assessment of uh, of the way these guys have played the last few weeks? Your last couple of tournaments have been good. The dual matches that you played, uh, what what have you taken away from those uh, uh, to determine how well your team is playing? Well, I'm things excited is you know Ollie's played one for us this year, and um, you know he's playing like we thought he would when we we signed him, and and Anders' his last two tournaments have been his best of the year. Bo wins in Tampa. Um, you know, Jason has a really nice event in Tampa, and, and um, so I think hopefully the best is ahead. Um, that we'll begin to see guys play well as a group, and 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 hopefully it results some pretty great results. Thanks a lot, Coach. Good luck this weekend. Thank you.